My name is Boris Platov, and I'm going to give you a lecture about the applied geostatistics. First of all, we need to talk about some terms that are widely used in geostatistics and in general in geological modeling. First is interpolation. Interpolation is a finding of the values of the function between the points where this function is set. That simply means, if we transfer it onto a geological language, that we are finding the values in the interwell space. We know value in the well, but we don't know the value between the wells. So we have to somehow calculate these values. And this is called interpolation. There are a lot of different methods of interpolation. One of the easiest is linear interpolation. In case of the linear interpolation, we simply connect the point with a straight line. This method is simple, but it cannot be used in all situations. For that reason, we uh, usually use a bit different method, which is called the spline interpolation. And that means the interpolation with the smooth lines, where we are connecting the points with this kind of smooth function. In addition to interpolation, we have to talk about extrapolation. On the slide, this is shown by the blue part of the function. If interpolation is the finding of the points uh, of the function between the points, extrapolation is finding of the values outside of the data set. In other words, it's prediction of the function. Extrapolation is always less accurate than interpolation. In addition to interpolation and extrapolation, we have to talk about approximation. Approximation means finding of the approximate solution. In this case, our function do not cross all the points, but it's uh, situated nearby to the points. Usually we use approximation in case when we cannot do a simple interpolation. Either function is too difficult or uh, it's more convenient to use the easier function. Let's talk about geostatistics. Geostatistics is the science and technology for the analysis, processing and presentation of the spatially distributed data using statistical methods. Uh, if we try to talk about that easily, just statistics is the statistics of the objects with the coordinates. Just statistics simulates distribution of the objects, phenomena and processes in geographic space. We need to have coordinates. For example, we have to have some wells with its coordinates and its properties. For example, porosity. If we get some points with the different porosities, we can apply just statistics, for example, to make a map of porosity. The main provision in just statistics is that our random variable, the functions that we are trying to find, is a stack of the trend, like the general way of working of the function, plus the random stationary residuals. 